Hello, Joe. Well, it's uh, trying times. We've had uh, better days and we'll have better days uh, with your help, too. Uh, Mr. President, Joe, I want to thank you for your continued and unequivocal support and the work of your entire administration to support us. Uh, the Israeli uh, people were deeply moved by the emotion that Admiral Kirby showed in his interview yesterday. It was, uh, it was deeply moving. And it represented the depth of commitment that you have, your administration have, and the American people across the board have for Israel. Uh, Joe, I want to give you a clear picture of the difficult situation we face. We were struck Saturday by uh, an attack whose savagery I can say we have not seen since the Holocaust. I mean, we had hundreds massacred, families wiped out in their beds and their homes, women brutally raped and murdered, over a hundred kidnapped, including children. And since we last spoke, the extent of this evil, it's only gotten worse. They, they took dozens of children, bound them up, burned them, and executed them. They beheaded soldiers. They, they mowed down these, these youngsters uh, who came to a nature festival and just, you know, like, put five jeeps around uh, a depression in the, in the soil. And like Bobby R., they mowed them down, you know, making sure that they killed everybody. This is, we've never seen such savagery in the history of the state. And they're even worse than ISIS. They're even worse than ISIS, and, and we need to treat them as such.